WFAA News. Hold on to your hats. Our cold front has arrived and with it some sleet. Did you guys experience that yet? Uh, thank you for joining us this midday. I'm Sonia Azad. Nice yesterday. Winter though returned overnight to meteorologist Greg Fields is here and Greg what we were talking about earlier. Greg was schooling me. It wasn't hail. If you thought it was hail, it's called soft hail. Uh, some people call it soft hail. Okay. Yeah, grapple. You know, that's what we see grapple. in the uh, with the uh, winter months. Yeah, uh, the uh, little pellets, snow yes. pellets. You can call them that as well. So you saw that. Oh yeah, I was in my car and I'm like, what is happening right now? The sun is kind of out, but is this? Like ice falling from the sky? It just kind of was, yeah. Okay. So we did have a little bit of that around uh, for today. Didn't cause a big problem, but some nice video that folks have been sending in. So we'll share that as we uh, go through the uh, day, of course. But we're looking at the UNT campus now. Yes, that air is colder, much colder compared to yesterday. We're looking at 40 degrees there right now, feeling like it's 32 on the UNT campus. Coming back over to Dallas, the uh, wind chill there of 33 with the uh, temperature of 40 degrees. Still going to see the mostly cloudy skies here early on, but we are expecting a little more sun to break out as we head into the afternoon becoming partly sunny. What's left of the uh, precip? Again, we had that delight rain, little sleet mixed in that grapple that we were talking about as well. Those are snow pellets that's moving on off to the uh, east out towards Sulphur Springs. Gotten some reports of that happening there over toward Paris and Clark. So that disturbance moves on away as we go through the rest of today and we'll focus on the uh, temperatures that will be uh, quite chillier compared to yesterday. We're over 30 degrees colder compared to 24 hours ago as that cold front began to make its way into uh, North Texas during the day on yesterday. So we're looking at upper 30s heading out to Gainesville right now. 38 along with Sherman and those low 40s once we get south of I-20 out to uh, Waxahachie there and Corsicana at 43. So we'll continue to see those brisk north winds in that 15 to 20 mile per hour range and those temperatures only getting into the lower 50s here this afternoon. We will see some partly sunny skies. The winds will ease up though as we head into this evening on into the overnight, but it will be chilly out there for us once again. Now another cold start tomorrow morning, but we do start to warm back up as we head toward the middle of the week. Another strong cold front though is on the way later late this week. That's going to be in the Thursday night, early Friday time frame. And yes, we are looking at at least uh, one more. Looks like a hard uh, freeze across North Texas. That will be widespread as we head on into Saturday morning. Could be looking at a little more wintry precip as well during that, that time frame. So we'll talk more about that for you coming up here in just a bit. But now back to you. 